Hello, I'm Steve Bernal. I'm a professional cellist here in Austin, Texas, and I would love to be a part of your special event, your special occasion, your wedding. Uh, I have lots of beautiful music to share with you, and the cello helps you create and provide an indelible ambience to any situation or occasion. I specialize uh, in playing solo cello, and I do arrangements of, of pop songs, for example, and I could, I'd be happy to uh, arrange a favorite song or two of yours for your special day. I came to Austin in 1984. I've been here for 30 years now, and uh, I've made many great friends, had many great experiences all across the board, played all kinds of music. Uh, I played bass in a band called Joe Rockhead, I played bass in the Killer Bees. My first professional gig was uh, playing bass for a band leader named Dan Del Santo in the mid 80s. And, uh, and since then I've done many things. I have played and toured and recorded with Alejandro Escovedo, uh, Monty Montgomery, Trish Murphy, uh, an Argentine artist named Federico Albel uh, for a few years in the early 2000s, and um, uh, I was cellist in the Temple Symphony Orchestra for a few years, and many other things. The cello is particularly suited for solo arrangements for many reasons, not least of which is the uh, the possibility for harmony and, and the range of the instrument, the low notes, the mid range, the high range, and many other effects. That you can get. And the cello can also be uh, strummed like a guitar, and, which makes a very familiar sort of sound to most listeners. Among many other techniques and textures and sounds. For example, You know, using the it's like kind of a self accompaniment with bass line and melody. I'm originally uh, a bassist, specifically uh, a rock and roll electric bassist, and uh, in general, and from childhood. But during the course of learning that instrument and being exposed to the various forms of rock and roll and led into my exploration of jazz as a teenager and, and many other idioms later on, Latin music, reggae music, various um, tropical and African rhythms and whatnot, and just the infinity of music itself uh, is basically what led me to the cello at some point about 15 years ago. Simply, I was curious and I always loved the sound of the instrument. I always loved the sound of this note. <laughs> it's my favorite one. The C sharp? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> C sharp, the low C sharp on the cello. I think with the way that I can arrange favorite pieces of music, whether it's a pop song or a traditional, more classical or uh, folk tune, for, for example, uh, for the instrument is my affinity towards the rhythmic aspect of music. And the, the sort of harmonic link that the bass is from the rhythm to the melody. You know, it's basically the musical glue in any sort of situation. And the cello provides that with this range in general.
and, and you can juxtapose it along, you know, with the upper range of the instrument as much as you can. And uh, that's just what makes it almost infinite to me. And I like to explore the edges of those boundaries and make as much music as I can. <laughs> Austin, probably more than anything, is the diversity of, of the music, the density of it, uh, and the potential to learn so many different styles. I consider myself to be about as versatile as I can be, I should say, because of that diversity, because of that density in the scene itself. You're just surrounded by so much all of the time, and it's a wonderful experience, and, it's, and I'm a curious person, and so it works. weddings and special events, uh, intimate special events for, for people who appreciate music and not only listen to it but, but really understand it. And what I've noticed a lot of the times during the course of a wedding because it's such an emotional event and so intimate, um, it seems as though I'm usually able to push those emotions right up to the surface of of the audience, if you will, or the listeners, or the, usually it's the friends and family that are gathered for the wedding itself. And that's the biggest response I get, is that, in a nutshell, to put it in physical terms, um, I, it's usually remarked to me after a, situa after a ceremony, for example, that I've made everybody cry. <laughs> And I'd like to think that I'm only a small part of that because, you know, usually I'm playing music that was written by someone else and it's just a matter of my interpretation at the time. And responding to the beauty of the instrument itself and, and doing it solo too is that I can respond to any change in situation right then and there as long as I'm paying attention and open and, and receptive uh, to any potential uh, change, uh, you know, so maybe someone makes a mistake, or someone is late, or someone's rushing, you know, and it, I can respond right then and there. And usually, I can do it in such a way to influence the response to a particular mishap, for example. And it seems to work, you know, I can, I, I don't know if it's me or the cello, but I think it's really the cello that puts everyone at ease. <laughs> Oftentimes, uh, when I'm approached by a potential client, they're not really sure what they want. Uh, the wedding is sometime in the future, we're planning way ahead, usually months in advance, and they just haven't gotten to that point with the details yet, especially the music, and that's where I can help them. I can, I can sort of guide them because I have a pretty large repertoire now of solo cello music, and I can... There have been times when I've just picked up my cello and put my phone down and played excerpts for them over the phone, for example. Uh, and usually I just give them a list of choices and then they go and do a little research on their own and pick what they like and, and we make a program from that. And then I'll also add that, that I'm willing to, to arrange you know, a piece or two to add to that list and, and, and that's how it works. Pretty simple. I do outdoor and indoor. Uh, I haven't done an underwater wedding yet. <laughs> I'm Steve Bernal. I'm a professional cellist here in Austin, Texas, and uh, I would love to be a part of your event, uh, your wedding, uh, any kind of special occasion that you may be celebrating. And I'm looking for beautiful music. Thank you.